Hey guys, welcome to Sova Keen. I am playing The Witcher 2 today on Linux. Witcher 2 Assassins of Kings Enhanced Edition. This is one game that I've had for quite a while. Played the original Witcher, loved it. Started playing Witcher 2 on Windows and never got around to finishing it because it's a long, detailed game. So, I'm going to start now and uh, actually I'm going to see first if there's a way to turn off the Naked Lady Bits. That would probably make it a little difficult QTEs. Oh no. That might be bad. Uh, doesn't look like there's a way to disable that stuff. Nope. Okay. Alright. Well, let's just jump into a new game then, huh? Default settings will be used. New game. Do you want to begin this tutorial? Yes, please. I forget what I'm doing with this. Let's see how good this game looks on Linux. I do have it set up to use OpenGL 3.2 uh, medium settings. So it might not be as pretty as everything else in the world, but we'll see what happens. Okay, opening the tutorial panel will pause the game so you can read the contents at your leisure. Hints can also be found inside the tutorial panels. When you initiate a new quest, the text beneath the minimap on the right of the screen will tell you what to do. Pay close attention to the tutorial panels appearing on the screen. Close and restore them any time. Tab. Press to restore tutorial panel. Tab to exit. Okay, rotate the camera to look around and select targets during combat. Control your character using keyboard or controller stick, not using that. You can also toggle between running and walking. Hmm, caps lock to toggle between running and walking. Damned leaky boat. My boots are soaked. Yet another boggy shithole. Oh, language. Wow, it looks nice, I gotta say. I do like the looks of it. Ah, picking up loot. Stand near a container and click on it to bring up a list of its contents. Select the items you wish to take. You can also pick up all items at once using space. Okay. Approach containers to bring up a window displaying the four most valuable items inside. Okay, so I can just press that. Examine corpse. Tournament announcement, squires, boots, and 50 orins. Take all. Open the inventory panel to browse through items Geralt has acquired. Some items need to be equipped, facilitating their use. Sort items by category. Uh, drop an item from the inventory. Okay, so up and down. No, press I to access inventory. Okay, I can look at weapons. Armor. Oh, Squire's boots. Soaked boots, squire's boots, resistance to incineration, 1%, let's do that. Okay, just drag it over, that works. Formula, healing brew. Action not allowed on this item. Okay, can't do that. Tournament announcement. Warriors of the world, knights, gladiators, soldiers, and armed ladies. The Grand Arena, famous throughout the North as the site of the Ultimate Combat Trials, opens its gates before you. Demonstrate your courage and sword skills. Claim the glory and the coin due to true heroes. Those acknowledged as worthy of the tournament will receive an invitation, enabling them to enter the Grand Arena and win eternal fame. Okay, sounds like fun. Do I want to drop those boots? Are they worth anything? It's not, I don't know, okay, whatever. Let's just exit and move on. Journal has been updated. Press J to open up the quest, okay? J, journal. Ask me to tell you Gerald's feats in the arena, yet I recall another adventure, a brief one. It took place just before the richer reached the town where he would gain everlasting glory. Leaky boat, soaked boots, and a bad mood. Great. Mm-hmm. Necrophages, okay. Move towards the quest objective. Short hint can be found on the mini map right of the screen. Okay. 
Ooh. Sounds like some nasty beasties out there. Let's see what we find here. Talk to a character, point the camera at him or her, and press the applicable button. Talk to the wounded knight. Okay. Who are you? I'm not gonna hurt you. Will you let me look at your wounds? Odd. You don't resemble a traveling preacher. Oh, damn the dogs, it hurts to talk. I wager my armor's the only thing keeping me in one piece. I'll find some help. Futile, I'm afraid. Around here, folk don't open their doors to strangers. You would do well to find my squire. I'd like to thrash his hide for fleeing from those corpse-eaters. Consider it my final wish. This is I a found very his body game. by the river. Listen, let me brew you a health potion. You're no witcher, so it could kill you. But if I'm not mistaken, you already think you're dead. There's a slim chance that your body will quell the toxins and regenerate. I'll expire in this hole before I let someone turn me into a mutant. That's not how it works. Stay calm and lie still. I need to find some herbs. Okay. Now well, it's going to teach me how to brew a potion, I hope. Ah, you have begun a new quest phase. Your objective is marked on the mini-map in the upper right corner of the screen. Great. J to open the journal. Select the quest you wish to track. Okay. J to open the journal. Track that quest. Okay. Tutorial. Formula. Rook. Quests. Step by step. Okay. Sure. Go to the place indicated on the mini-map. You'll find the plants you need. Okay, so hidden walls here. It does look a little bit jerky, I'll tell you. Okay, open. 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 It's not opening. Okay. Um, guess I'll go back this way. Somewhere else I can go? Can I go up here? Well, how am I supposed to go get plants? Choose medallion. Use the medallion to detect nearby containers, herbs, monsters, places of powers, and threats. So then press the corresponding key. So press Z. And I will find stuff. Pick herbs. Okay, take all. Herbs, take all. There's lots of hidden stuff around here. Oh, mushrooms. Okay. How do I do this? Prepare a potion, bomb, or blade oil. You must have both the formula detailing its composition as well as ingredients containing the substances listed in the formula. Mixtures can only be prepared while meditating. Formula and ingredients can be purchased from shopkeepers or found in various locations. Ingredients can also be harvested from plants and carved from monster corpses. Sounds like fun. Bring up the quick menu with controls. Select the central icon to begin meditating. Okay, begin meditating. Then I can go alchemy. Healing brew. Press enter to create. Oh, good. Well, that didn't take long. Now I give the potion to the wounded knight. Talk. Okay. What's he got to say now? Knock back this potion. Try not to vomit. Drink it. Did he drink you're still it? alive, so that bodes well. But you've got a ways to go before you're at full health. Now you have to sit and wait. You're no mutant, so it'll be a couple of days before you recover and we can get you out of here. Thank you, Witcher. Oh, hallowed grieve! Didn't have the chance earlier. I'm Geralt of Rivia. Bolton of Ironfoot. What I wanted to here? try my luck in the arena, but some corpse eaters corpse surprised eaters. me. Those are the necrophages. My horse reared and I came crashing down in full armor. They pounced upon me with their claws. Though broken, I managed to drive them off and crawl here. Pitiful story, but there it is. Hmm. That could mean some paid work for me. Doubtful. 
If the corpses weren't eaten, they would rot, emit a stench, and breed pestilence. Ah, damn the dogs! Those who fall in the arena, their bodies are cast into the ravine. The dead offer little in terms of diversion, I'm afraid. Except perhaps to monsters. Hmm. I wanted to try my Oh, I already went through that. Gaff. Those who f Okay, get, get well, well we Bolton of Ironford. You must take my invitation. If but half of what I've heard about witches is true, you ought to manage well in the arena. Okay. Thanks, Bolton. I thank you. And now, Geralt of Rivia, if you've no objection. Okay, go ahead and get some sleep. An invitation to the arena. Go take part in the tournament, okay? Hopefully it'll teach me how to fight when I get there. Yeah, the mouse movement isn't the smoothest in the Linux version. I remember Who being stalks a the night? Be gone, cursed soul, or I'll stick the hounds on ya! Got corpse eaters on this side, so I'll take your hounds any day. A jester, eh? You're all jesters. You all think you're droll till you enter the <laughs> arena. No room for joking around in there. I'm not trying to be funny. I'm soaked and I'm freezing. Let me in. Ah, a vampire. I'll not let a bloodsucker in. Oh, no. I've got eels and garlic here. What do you say to that? I'll gladly submit to the eels and garlic trial, and the running water trial, and the beer trial. Who knows what you are? Evil crawls <laughs> the night, corrupting the righteous. I'll wait for morn for the cock to crow. If the rising sun don't scare you off, I'll let you in. You want me to wait here? You there. What an ass. All right. Let's find a place to rest. Well, that wasn't very nice. Meditate to a predetermined hour instead of waiting. Meditation panel. The option to meditate until dawn. Okay. Okay, meditate. Meditate. Until dawn. Okay, and I'm done. Now let's try again. Still there, foul soul! Yeah, I'm still here. And the cock has crowed. As far as being foul, well, I may smell a bit. Has it got an invitation? It has. Then it may enter. Good luck to it in the arena. Uh, it. What is that saying? It puts the lotion on its skin. It puts the lotion on its skin. <laughs> One, draw your steel sword. Two, draw your silver sword. Use the same key to, to sheath your sword. Okay, draw the steel sword. Great. Focus on chosen foe and mark him. Okay. Great, well, attack until your foe dies or you select another target. Move the camera to select your current combat target. It's a sight on each of the opponents as they are highlighted. was cool. Ah, parrying, dodging, and reposts. Slow opponents mount strong attacks. Swift opponents mount weaker but more frequent attacks. Fighting either requires dodging and parrying. And keep in mind, parrying only reduces the damage rather than eliminating it entirely. You cannot parry magic attacks. Dodge them or cast signs to protect yourself from them. Okay, how do I dodge and parry? Vigor is represented by the yellow bar, upper left corner of the screen. Vigor drops every time you parry an opponent's strike. Cast a sign. Low Vigor will prevent you from casting signs, though it will not limit your ability to parry. Okay. Parry your opponent's attack by pressing and holding E just before he strikes. Okay, good. 
evaded any rows. There's space and okay. Yeah. Great. Repost. Counter your opponent's attack with a repost. Repost. Hold down the parry key and attack when the repost marker appears on your bow. Okay. Seeing it. Yeah. Oh. If I just sneak him around a bit, come on now. Oh. Yeah. to attack. Okay, I'm waiting. I'm not seeing any icon. What am I doing wrong? Happening. Just die, kill him. Drive him off the edge, drive him off the edge. Come on. I don't understand what's going on here. Finally, there's an icon. Finally! <laughs> Oi. Press the 5 key to cast Ard at my opponent. Okay. Okay, in addition to dealing regular damage, Geralt and his foes can inflict critical effects in combat. Additional effects induced by attacks remain active for a certain time, so that a knockdown, great. Some foes are immune to special effects. Look at the top of the screen to see the effects dealt to Geralt. There we go. That was pretty cool. Select a sign by pressing corresponding key. Bring up the quick menu to select a sign. Press and hold the quick menu key, select sign, and release the key to resume playing. Also select signs while scrolling through the sign list. Okay, uh, let's, how about Igni? No? Ah, uh, the mage has dealt the incineration critical effect to Ger Geralt. Witcher will take additional damage as long as the effect remains active. Positive and negative effects remain active for a specific time. The effect duration is displayed at the top of the screen. Bleeding, blinding, incineration, 
freezing, poisoning, and intoxication. Okay. Vitality is low. Focus on defense and cast the Quen sign. Okay, which one's Quen? Quen. Wonder how many more will turn up. Assume temporary control of your foes with the Axie sign. Careful! Okay, let's Axie, Axie, Axie. Magical trap that is traced on the ground. Yurden traps immobilized opponents. Yurden traps immobilized opponents. There we go. Trap foes and attack them from behind. Buy time to flee if the fight is not going as planned. Okay. So I need Yurden. Wow, that blew up on me. Retrieve all items in the chest. To place an item in quick slot, open the inventory and drag selected items like bombs, traps, daggers, and lures to the quick slots. Okay. Put them where? Bombs. There. Okay, and then there. Oh, cool. And there's other weapons. Ranged weapons can go there. What's that? Trap. Slows foes down. Okay. Scroll through quick slot items to select bombs, traps, lures, and daggers previously placed in quick slots. Bring up the quick slot items from the quick menu. Okay. Bombs. Traps from the quick slots and use them to defeat your foe. Press R to place a trap. Okay, select traps. Okay. No limit on the number of traps you can place. Pretty good. So like daggers. Dagger. 
first six levels, you'll only be able to unlock abilities from training path. To acquire more talents, be able to spend them on abilities from three main paths, magic, alchemy, and swordsmanship. Okay, so the next level, so press C. Mutagens can be used to modify Geralt's abilities. To use a mutagen, go to the character development panel and find an ability with a mutagen slot on the training path. Okay. So we'll press C. Okay. Swordsman, training. The Witcher training path. Um. Hmm. The ability to redirect arrows, that'd be cool. Bigger regeneration during combat. Oh, I get more vitality. Parry blows from all directions. Unlock the ability to parry blows from all directions. Damage reduction while parrying with full vigor. Dagger throwing. Unlocks the ability to throw daggers. Damage dealt by daggers plus 20. Hmm. Oh, I think at this point it'll be parrying that I take. Oh, I have something I can mutate. Mutate, fortitude. Alchemy ingredient, lesser power mutagen. Mutate ability, yes. Cool. And then I can still acquire a level of parrying. Yes. Cool. Final trial awaits. Make sure to prepare. Make sure you're about to face three waves of opponents before the trial begins. Explore the chest in the arena and use the items you find there. Remember to drink some potions and coat your blades with oils. Also fill your click slots with the items you deem most useful. Any time by select walking into the highlighted circle. Okay. I leveled up again. Do I have any more mutagens here? Uh, that's all this stuff. Well, I've got nothing else to mutate. Okay. Sectorial hang man's venom flagration. Tolgar winter salmon bones. Okay, let's take it all. This fight requires some preparation. Speaking by drinking several potions. Should find a few in the chest in the arena. Each potion you consume increases your toxicity. Your maximum toxicity level indicated on the right side of the screen limits the number of potions you can drink. To bring potions, bring up the quick menu, begin meditating, and choose drink potions. Okay. So, step in the highlighted circle to begin, but I want to meditate and drink potions. Okay, what does this do? Significantly increase vigor while reducing vitality and chance of causing critical effects. Minus 30% vitality plus one vigor. Hmm. Swallow. Accelerates vitality regeneration. Hmm. Well, that's nice. Okay, well, let's go with that then. And one of those. Okay, drink. Wow. He just leaves trash everywhere, doesn't he? Okay, now what? Can't do alchemy. I already drank potions, so I guess it's leave. Okay, and then what do I got here? Oh, sword. Okay. How do I use potions? Great. Enhancements. Insectoid oil. Damage dealt to insectoids, 20%. Damage dealt to humans, 20%. Yes. And with 
insectoids, I might as well do this one anyway. Okay. Put down a trap or two. Conflagration trap, that might be nice to have. Cap shot, bomb, wounds all within range with shrapnel. Cool. Stuns and freezes all within range, that's a nice one too. Okay. Well, let's let's give it a try. Let's go. Dodge out of the way again. me. I'm dead. I'm dead. They killed me. Okay. <laughs> Except, apparently, I'm done, and it wants me to play on easy, because that's how bad I am. All right, guys, that'll be the end of episode one. And that was a lot of fun doing the tutorial. That's it for now, guys. Bye.